I'm Professor Sanaudi uh, from uh, New York University Computer Science Department. I'm also affiliated at NYU New York, uh, NYU Abu Dhabi in uh, computer science. I came here last year to build the computer science department. I uh, was going around and talking to different departments in the Arab world, and I felt that NYU Abu Dhabi is a place where um, we have to find our place in the Arab world, and I wanted to. Um, I was thinking of an event that will actually bring a collaboration between the different departments in the Arab world in computer science and also NYU New York and the different international students to collaborate and to uh, have some type of competition and collaboration in computer science. And uh, one of the things that I'm passionate about is actually computer science and innovation in computer science, problem solving in computer science to build application for the social good. Because I think computer science is a science that allows you uh, to solve a lot of problems. I think any innovation and any contribution to the humanity to basically different field will uh, be uh, in essence dependent on computer science solution, whether it's the environment, health, um, even the sciences, uh, even inter the entertainment I industry, media, journalism, uh, we can see that there is always a, an essential component of computer science into that. And um, so I wanted to uh, bring together experts and students from all over the Arab world, top students, uh, that have been nominated by uh, their departments, along with uh, international students, along with experts, along with um, uh, developers and entrepreneurial uh, entrepreneurship um, to basically build applications for the social good. Uh, and this week, this three-day exciting event have proved that this is something needed, something that is important. Uh, we need to create a culture in computer science about collaboration, about building applications, problem solving, teach our students to really look within themselves and come up with solution. There is a lot of problem spending for solutions in all different fields. And we need our students to start thinking about those solutions, whether it's creating an animation, uh, faster algorithm for animation, or faster algorithm for um, uh, basically uh, um, rendition, or for um, image processing, for graphics. So we need these kind of solutions. We need these students to care about um, what's also going on with, in their communities. Innovations to me, it's not just only um, basically creating a new idea, but innovation is also part of problem solving, connecting these sort of new ideas, uh, these brilliant solutions to solve a problem in a community. To me, this is the brilliance. I mean, if Google proved anything, the success of Google is to really that niche is to try to bring innovation and to solve a problem that is that people care about. And I think that's something that if we introduce our students to, we will be really successful in, uh, in basically training the new generation into um, new ideas, new ways of thinking, and solving a lot of the economic problems. Um, they'll become empowered to do their own startups. This is going to be the new wheel for the economy. Um, you can see that in New York, for example, Mayor Bloomberg is himself taking the initiative to um, invite university to establish hubs for uh, startups. So there is a bid by Stanford, that a bid by other universities to create in New York a hub for startup like a Silicon Alley. This proves that basically startups, computer science, business innovation is teaming up to be the new economy, building the new future economy. So computer science in so many ways is driving society now. And the young people understand that. We need the institutions to be able to understand that. We need computer science departments to um, to include that in their in in their curriculum to be part of the culture. <laughs>